In this video, let us continue to solve problems based on cyclic quadrilateral. Now here we have a question which reads like this. If diagonals of a cyclic quadrilateral are diameters of the circle. So here we have the figure here. We've got a cyclic quadrilateral ABCD and then we've got the diagonals which is AC and BD. So they are the diameters of the circle. So if the diagonals of a cyclic quadrilateral are the diameters of the circle through the vertices of the quadrilateral, and most importantly, the diameters of the circle are through the vertices of the quadrilaterals, that is BD and AC. Then prove that it is a rectangle. If that is the case, we need to prove that ABCD is a rectangle as well. It is a cyclic quadrilateral, no doubt. But we haven't solved many problems which has got a rectangle in a circle. So how do we go about proving this? Now let ABCD be a cyclic quadrilateral such that its diagonals AC and BD are the diameters of the circle through the vertices ABCD. We need to assume that it is already. So since AC is the diameter and angle in a semicircle is a right angle, so therefore we've got so therefore we've got angle ABC equals 90 degrees. ABC equals 90 degrees and angle ADC also equals 90 degrees. That is because AC is the diameter. So if you draw a triangle using the diameter as a third side, then, then it obviously becomes angle in a semicircle. So this angle and this angle are equal to 90 degrees. And this is one of the most important properties of a circle. So similarly, now we considered AC as the diameter and we found out that angle ABC and angle ADC are 90 degrees each. Now let us take BD as a diameter and apply the same thing to that as well. So when you take BD as a diameter, you have two other triangles in which you can apply the property that angles or angle in a semicircle is a right angle. So we have angle BCD which becomes a right angle and angle BAD or DAB which becomes a right angle. So therefore we have angle ABC equal to angle BCD equal to angle CDA equal to angle DAB equal to 90 degrees. So hence ABCD is a rectangle. Let us solve another problem. This problem was not very complicated. It was pretty simple. As long as you know the properties of circles and the basics of circles, 